What's up guys, Ivan Carranza here and today we're taking a look at the Harley Benton Hot Rod Deluxe PJ Base. The Deluxe Hot Rod PJ has an outer body with a high gloss trans red hot rod finish. It's got a one piece maple neck and a rose acer or rose acer fretboard which is basically thermally treated or cooked maple. It's got 20 frets, a modern C neck profile, and 42 millimeters at the nut, which is like a regular P base. As far as the hardware goes, we've got a traditional chrome bridge design with chrome tone controls and traditional clover style tuning machines. As far as the electronics go, we've got two pickups on the neck or middle position, we've got a precision style or P style pickup. And on the bridge position, we've got a J or jazz bass style pickup. For the controls, we've got a volume for the precision style pickup, a volume for the jazz style pickup, and a tone control. Let's now go straight on to the sound samples. For those of you who don't know, Harley Benton is the house brand of Thoman, which is an instrument store here in Germany. And if I'm not mistaken, they're pretty much the biggest instrument store in Europe at the moment. And this bass costs 129 euros. I actually wanted to get the cheapest, cheapest bass they had, but that wasn't in stock at the moment, so they were kind enough to send me this one. And before the bass arrived, I was thinking like, 
you know, it's gonna be a, it's a cheap instrument, the setup is gonna be bad, uh, the, the electronics are gonna be bad and all that. And I was proven wrong <laughs> the second I took it out of the, the case. Um, the bass is very well set up. The, the feel of the neck is great, it's really smooth. There is no sharp edges anywhere. The frets are dressed properly. The finish and the fit of the neck are all great. I mean, it's a beautiful instrument in my opinion. Um, and to, to sum it up, you know, I wish I had an instrument like this when I was learning to play bass. This is, is a lot more fun than some starter or beginner instruments. Um, even to the degree that I usually don't really like P-based widths uh, here at not the, the 42 millimeter necks uh, nuts and the kind of like the the shape of the neck on P bases most of them feel like too chunky for me like too too wide uh, this one feels I mean it was not like I had to get used to it a little bit while recording but it's also good that it even maybe consider changing the specs of a, of a base that I have on order um, because it really feels good um, and I mean, I don't. It's kind of hard to say something negative about the base because it costs 129 euros. You know, um, the only thing that I would mention is that the pickups are kind of low output. Um, I had to crank really my gain to to record, um, and the bridge pickup is kind of weak. Uh, on its own, it sounds like you could hear it sounds kind of thin. However, I actually really like how the P bass pickup sounds and also how both pickup together also sound. I think when you're running the P and the J pickup together, it gives you kind of like a grindy, almost like a J style bass kind of tone. So that's pretty cool. The bass is a tiny bit neck heavy as well, but it's nothing major. When you're sitting down, if you put your arm on, the, on this part of the bass, then it stays in place. And when standing up, it stays probably at like at this angle. It doesn't fall completely to parallel so it's not really serious overall i think this is a great instrument especially considering the price point so you want to start to play bass for example i think you can't go wrong with this um, you can always upgrade the pickups or the bridge and the tuners later and you would have a really solid instrument if you're for example a guitar player that just wants to record some bass at home um, you can get one of these to do it it sounds great if you're a teacher for example and want to have a spare or backup instrument for your students you can always get one of these and it's gonna be a solid instrument for them to learn with if you're interested in Harley Benton products I would encourage you to go over to the Toman website which is toman.de there's also an English version which I'm gonna put down below and if you like the video I would really appreciate it if you could subscribe to the channel and let me know what you think in the comments I'll catch you guys in the next one Take care.